It's Emma. And today's video is going to be on 10 things that aggravate me. I got a text. And so these 10 things are things that just absolutely drive me insane. And they're not like necessarily anything bad. They're just things that make me crazy inside. You guys might get aggravated by it too, so I'm kind of making this video to let you know that like you're not alone if these things bother you too. So let's get started. Number one, one word texts. I go absolutely mental when somebody texts me K, hey, cool, yeah, lol, any of those things drive me crazy because I'm, I'm a writer so when I text it's not like I'm just texting what's up. I send like paragraphs in my texts. So when somebody re replies, I got a text again. <laughs> somebody, when somebody replies with just like one of those words, I like have to keep the conversation going or like it drives me insane. Cause like if I text you, like I want to talk to you. So it just drives me crazy. Don't, if you text me one word text and I reply to it, then I must love you. Number two, when your friends don't understand that you have other friends. This is like one of the most hated things in my life because if I'm like going to somebody's house that's like my friend and it might be like a new friend and I don't like know them very well and when my close friend like freaks out, it drives me insane because it's like, yes, I love you a lot. I will always love you but I have other friends and I just want you to understand that and I really hope that like I'm not like that so if I ever like do any of these things to you because like, like if I know you in real life or something let me know. Casually drinking water. Felt like I had to film that. Number three. When your parents don't understand that you don't want to clean your room. Yes, mom, I know you have told me to clean my room 10 times in the past two hours, and I will do it when I feel like it, not when you want me to. Number four, when teachers tell you not to talk in class. When one of my teachers yells, I gotta be quiet, what goes through my mind is like, you know, no, I'm not gonna be quiet because, because of all the homework you give us, we have no time to see our friends after school, and this is the only time during the week we can't. But in my mouth, I'm just like, yes, ma'am. Number five. When people randomly decide to join into your conversations. Like, for example, I'll be talking to someone and be like, yeah, you watched that show last night. Oh, it was so great. Blah, blah, blah. And then out of nowhere, this random head appears in your little space bubble of the conversation and is like, yeah, I love that show. Like, seriously, did you really feel the need to do that? Number six. When a song on the radio is played over and over and over again. Like, you may hate it, but it's played so much that you know all the words. Duh, that's so annoying. Number seven. People who feel the need to make you feel bad about what you like. Like, for example, I'm a big directioner and like not one bit a believer. But during that whole Directioner fever video war thing that I didn't care about people supporting Justin Bieber because I respect people's opinions unlike some real people who just like make you feel bad about it but like if anyone ever tells you like not to like something don't because your opinion <coughs> is what matters not theirs. Number eight. Really really rude store employees. Like, I don't care, little Mr. Cashier, if you're having a hard day. We don't need to take it out on me. I'm buying clothes from you, I'm giving you business, and I'm paying you 30 bucks. So when you just grunt and hand me my bag, well, that doesn't make you want to come back now, does it? Number nine. Show-offs. People who love to brag and make you feel lesser than them. Maybe because they got a new phone or because they just think they're smarter than you. I don't know what it is, but anyone that brags and likes to show off about what they do drives me crazy. I don't know how I'm gonna show you this one using digits, but um, number 10, here I'll try. One, zero, 10. I'm thirsty today. 
Okay, I couldn't think of anything else reasonable because I'm like out of things that bother me. But here's something that bothers me that I guess I'll just have to use for number 10. How long it takes for me to transfer a video from iMovie to YouTube. Like, it's so annoying because the first time I ever did that, it said uploading video. And that took like 10 minutes to go through the whole little, filling up the little like line thing with blue. You know how it does that when you're waiting for something to load. It did uploading video for 10 minutes. And then when I thought it was done, no, it moved on to like exporting video or something else. It was so annoying. So that's it guys. Those are the 10 things that aggravate me. Please tell me if you feel the same way about any of those things so I don't feel alone. Also, I have a couple more videos planned for the rest of this week, but please still keep suggesting things because, like, I need ideas because I'm not a very creative person. Mwah! Bye, guys!